you guys. Sometimes parents come up to me and they're like, why should I have a mental health advocate when we are attending IEP and 504 meetings? And that's a great question. A mental health advocate knows and it has expertise in mental illness, particularly in pediatric mental illness. And they're able to bring to the table the latest information that is current and it's evidence-based practice. The other reason is that sometimes it helps to have a person who's not there with that child so much for clarity of vision and can offer maybe a different perspective than the parent or the teacher who spends a great deal of time with this child. So they bring another ability to just offer other options that can be considered. And the third option is that the mental health advocate can be a resource to both the parent, the teachers, and the administrator to say, hey, how would this present in this, this child? What are some things that we can do to accommodate them, to help them be more comfortable and to be able to remain in school most of the time or as much as they possibly can.